This is the vegetable soup everyone in this town claims gives you the ability to give birth to twins once eaten. So we are here to try it out. Probably after eating this, who knows, my next baby will be twins. <laughs> <laughs> this claim is based on the fact that this town has the highest number of twins births in the world. So how many twins do you have in your family? Twelve. Twelve? Yes. There is barely any house in this town that has no twin in them. Almost all women in this town give birth to twins at their third or fourth birth at maximum. So probably the one you told me is twins. Yeah. Yeah. Well, check out the check. Yeah. 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 Yeah Bet than anywhere in the world and today's video i'm going to show you so many twins that they have in this place what's your name what's your name and these are the first twins that we are interviewing but there are so many twins in this room as you move around this community almost every house you go to you will find there are twins there why do they have so many twins in this community let's find out <laughs> My name is Wale Ahmed. Okay. Why do you think there are so many twins in this Ibora? They, uh, why do twins. you have so many twins in Ibora? The reason why is according to our forefathers. Okay. So they said uh, in this Ibora here, uh, they are eating the, this uh, steel in Lhasa or what, or what are they call it. That is why they are using twins in Ibora here. Because all of, all the what eh? this is the nation's of swings. But don't other people also eat that same leaf in other places but they don't have twins. So why is your own different? Oh, in, in this particular town, yes. it's only this town they uh, eat uh, this uh, leaf, the particular leaf. So it's only this town that have the leaf. If I carry the leaf and go to Abuja and eat it, will I have twins? Uh, in, in what? If they take that leaf to Abuja, if we say, they will take the this what the water, yes. uh, the water yes. along with the leaf to Abuja. If they continue eating uh, this leaf, it uh, uh, will deliver twins. Are you sure? Ah, very sure. So if you are to estimate, let's say for every ten delivery, yes, how many are twins? At least we have four. For every ten delivery, yes, that be at least four. Four. Oh wow! So that means as you move around, almost every compound. There, <laughs> it, hardly you will see any family. Any family that doesn't have that twins? Yes. Igbora, I say, oh, we have up to between 350 to 400,000 okay. population. population. Yes. So among that, can among you estimate that, right, how many twins we have? We should have about 150. About 150. Wow, that is almost, almost close to uh, Almost 4.5%, uh, 4.5 out of 10. His name is? Kendi, that and your name is? Taiwo Downs. Taiwo. So I have here Kainde and I have here Taiwo and they are also twins and they are in their 80s. I'm 22. 14 years old. 13 years. My name is Taiwo Olanese. My name is Kenny Olanese. My name is Alawale Taiwo. My name is Alawale Kainde. My name is Anusi Yudkis Ayamide. Anusi Ibrahim Ayamide. Olamide. And we are twins. We are twins. We are twins. Okay. How many twins do you have in your family? Like, if I count, it's maybe like 12. 12? Yes. yes. How many other twins do you have in your school? Many twins. Too many twins? There are so many twins in your school? Yeah. Even in your class? Yeah. Ah, so all of you come together, you see yourself, right? Yeah. Oh. My home mother, born, born twins. Okay. And we are six in our own family. But in our own family, we have twins, like 12. Maybe my mommy's sister born. Okay, your extended family. Yes. Yeah. You're about 12. Yes. But your own mother, you pull at six. Yes. Are you twins? Uh, uh, you no, I'm not twins. Okay. But I deliver twins. You deliver twins? Even my brother and sister deliver twins. How many twins do you have? I, I have about two. Two two. We're moving around the town, so stopped over here to buy something. And right here, we are trying to buy something. The woman that is selling it also have twins. So, virtually every home and every places that you go, you just find twins everywhere. 
All right, so I'm just going to ask her a couple of questions as well, since she already has twins as well. I have um, twins. Okay. They are boys. They are boys. How old are they? Two of them are, are boys. Uh, a year plus. A year plus. Okay. So what is the one you are back in? Uh, this, oh, is this is Taiwo. This is Taiwo. This is Kaide. Uh, this is Kaide. Kaide yes. is sleeping. Yes, sir. <laughs> Taiwo is also sleeping. <laughs> okay, lovely. So what, like, what do you think is what makes a lot of people here to have twins? Um, someone said that we are eating um the look on okra leaf. Oh, okay. So some people say that uh, just because of that okra leaf. Okay. So that's what causes it. Yes. Okay. How many children do you have in total? Oh, I have four. Okay. This is my firstborn. This is my second one, so my third one is twins. Okay, so your third bet, you now gave twins. Yes, sir. Uh, but your, your other family members, do they also have twins? Even my sister, she have twins. Your sister have twins? Yes. But you, you are not twins? I'm not twins. In your own family, are there twins? There are plenty. In your own family? Yes. How many twins? My sister. So my my grandma, she, uh, she have um, four twins. Your grandma so they are uh, Yes. Wow. And your own mother has how many twins? There is nothing to Not your own mother. Uh, but now, your grandma has four twins. Yes. Your own mother doesn't have. Uh, but you but and my Sana sister have twins. Twins. Yes. And you two, you have. Yes. Is there any challenges of raising twins? Or is it the same thing as raising normal kids? I don't have any challenges. No challenge. Is yes. it the same? Yes. Okay. Just to validate some of these claims of having multiple beds in this town in Ibora, so I decided to check out the whole facility and just check the record so we can see in every 10 beds given in this town, how many are actually twins? But I need twins, Lord, twins. Out of every 10 beds, how many yeah. are twins? Uh, out of 10, out of at least 10, one. How many are twins? One. One. Yeah. At least one. Yeah. Out of every 10 beds. And these beds are usually recorded in your register. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So as and I, as someone is working here, do you think there's any challenges in terms of giving beds to trees? No challenges. If there is, we use to river. Okay. But we don't have any challenges. So most people that give birth to trees here, is it by CS or by normal delivery? We have normal. If normal we delivery. detect there is any challenges, we quickly refer. Mm. But more people give birth here normally. Normally. Not CS. Not CS. Okay. Do you know of what is the reason why people give birth to twins a lot in Ibora? Do you have an idea? Mm. Mm. In this, uh, our local government, um, in my town, they used to believe that we are eating one food calling Elasa and Amala. Yes, or crawl leaf. Okay. So we believe that eating of that. Uh, Food aids the, aids the giving birth to the multiple, multiple births. Uh, would you believe that? Or do you think it's I possible? believe in it, though. I believe, believe yeah. yes. So, probably have some properties there that there is something inside that uh, leaf. But I heard it's not the leaf, and I heard there is also water. Ibora water. Mm, we believe that in Ibora, it's only Ibora water that we can use to cook that. Elasa before it can draw, but if you use other water, it will not draw. Uh, okay. But you have not tried it. I've tried it with other water. With other water. If we are going to Lagos and we are going to uh, to cook Elasa there, we used to carry our own water down to to that cook it there. To Lagos. Oh, I see. I want to give birth to twins. Come so, and eat Elasa. <laughs> so I'm thinking that if I don't eat Elasa with my wife without work, I will have to say. Carry water, water, and then I don't know. It's tradition. It's tradition. <laughs> uh, so you don't think it's something that has to do with God. You just think there's something in the environment, in the food you eat that really causes that to happen. That is what research says. So research. They believe in that Elasa before the the implementation of this um, IVF. Okay. But when the IVF comes, it also is and increase the multiple baths. So it actually it costs a lot of money to travel around Nigeria to shoot these documentaries that you see, beside the other challenges and risks that are actually involved. So if you really appreciate the work that we do and you want to support us, please you can check the description of this video and you can actually buy us a coffee or you can use the super thanks to donate to what we do or 
best you can as well join our monthly youtube membership where you can give to us every month just to support our travel all right so thank you very much and i look forward to getting more of your support you know so we can continue to shoot and to document the stories around nigeria okay. this is um ilasa ilasa yes now people should oh. eat it when they are eat it i believe that when they eat it some people gave birth to twins okay Yes. And so you've been eating this? Yes. So that means you're going to give birth to twins? Yes. When you marry? <laughs> you are sure? Nah, God, no. <laughs> so you think it's a matter of... Is what they told you or that's your belief? No. We are belief. You believe that? Yes. Oh, really? This thing. So don't you think that, assuming you leave this town now, you marry somebody that's not from this town, you may not give birth to twins? We can give birth to twins. So Since we are thing. eating the soup this before... Soup. So somebody that is not from this town, come and start eating this thing now. She can give it. Please let me have one. I want okay. to go. <laughs> so you can you can use other water to cook it though. Ah, which water will I use to cook it? Eh, Igbora. Igbora water. Yes. yes. Okay, uh, my dear wife. They said if I eat this thing, drink Igbora water, we we'll have twins. So now I want to burn twins. So I'm going to buy this to take it home. Plus <laughs> Ibora water. Ibu have water, ba? Yes, now. Give Ibora now. water. I'm taking it home. So my wife will burn twins. No problem. We need twins. <laughs> We are here to celebrate the weekend of multiple parts. Uh, a lot of twins, you can see many people from all walks of life are here in Ibora. Uh, you can see their laughter for you. Every year, the town hosts a twin festival celebration where you get a chance to see most of the twins born in this town. What we are doing is that we are celebrating the uniqueness in multiple parts and we are projecting to the world that this town, Igora, has the highest number of multiple parts in the whole world. So that is what we are projecting to the world. This is a cultural tourism event. So what you're seeing being cooked right now is called ilasa. This is the very soup that everyone claims that if you eat, you actually will have the ability to give birth to twins. And we are here to test it out. It's time to try out the soup itself. It is right here. It is ready. Let's see. So right there, I have... What's this one? Is it amala? This is amala. So here I have... Here I have the ilasa. And here, some beef. As an explorer, you try out everything. So after eating it, if I have twins, well, don't blame me. <laughs> okay. Just test it normal, like the normal of product you normally eat. That I test. It's no. Normally they will push you on it. While the high rate of twin birth has not been medically proven to be as a result of eating this vegetable, one thing for sure is that the food they eat, the water they drink, their environment, their DNA may all have a role to play in the high rate of twin birth in this town. But well, the community still believe it's as a result of the vegetable. So what do you think? <laughs>